Hello Alec. I would like to hear some thoughts about this hand that I played recently. Villain was on the button and he opens up pre-flop with a raise to $3.50, something he did pretty much the entire time once he was chip leader. Small blind calls this bet. I got a discount to call, so I decided to see the flop with two suited cards in the big blind. To the flop. Flop comes the dream, where I hit a set on the paired board. Small blind checks. I knew that the villain was going to see bet so I check called to slow play my trips. As I assume, he bets again and I call. Turn comes the 8, and I make my full house. At this point, I decided to check again because I'm fairly sure he would rep strength and try to steal the pot. Sure enough, he bets 15. I rearranged him to 30, hoping he would 3 bet all in. I read him as having nothing and just trying to bully the pot as chip leader. He calls instead. The river comes with 10 and 2 pairs the board. My house improved. I didn't want to check now because I was afraid he might check behind and I would lose value. Hence, I shove, and he snap calls. He flips a higher full house with a 10. So I just busted out of a 50 cents $1 cash game with a hand that was, in hindsight, an easy lay down. However, in playing it, it was very very difficult to fold. My questions are. Should I have re-raised more on the turn? Are there any other mistakes in my play? I'm looking for any advice about this hand in particular or playing monsters in general. Thank you so much in advance. Austin.